Are you taking a picture or of me doing this? Huh? What, do you, what do you got there? A hoe. Let's get this party started by pulling out this motor. I'm going to leave the trans in for now because I am not 100% sure what I am going to do. I don't know if I'm going to replace it with an original motor. Okay, the motor's blowing in this thing. Rod went through the block. Or if we're going to LS swap it or something similar. Uh, this thing's been sitting for a couple months. I come over here, open the hood, to start looking at it, and something weird is going on. I don't know if this thing got hot when it blew up, and I just didn't notice it, or if it got cold and it froze over. But I come over here and open the hood. This thing's been sitting a couple months. And this hose on the radiator was off. And the hose down here that goes to the block was off. So that is kind of weird. So I've never, I don't remember ever pulling a motor by myself. So I'm going to do this on the fly and disconnect our battery. It's probably dead anyway. But uh, start pulling stuff off. Try to get this block out. You, sir, are fixing to die. Sitting here taking this hose off. And this son of a biscuit eater decides he wants to sting me.
Would you looky there? Look who's peeking out to say hello. Little Mr. Rod. I think that is going to conclude the first video of the motor swap series for the Nissan Hardbody Project Sin. Anyways, so I've got the transmission out. I went ahead and pulled the transmission out. We may be able to sell that. It was still working. Bran is over there talking over my video. Um, I could possibly, I gotta pull the head on this and see if it's any good. Pull this intake manifold off, see if it's any good. We may be able to resell some of this, make a little cash for the new motor. I am leaning heavily towards a 5.3 truck motor I'm leaning heavily towards a 5.3 motor out of a truck uh, Tahoe etc etc with the transmission the control mod the uh, computer and the wiring harness See if we're smart enough to figure out how to get that thing in here. Have to get a new radiator or use one out of something else. Radiator, have to figure out fuel system. Um, floor shifter. I'll probably put bucket seats in this thing so we got room for a floor shifter wherever it lands. Have to do some drive line work. So it will be a project. We'll probably take the grill off. That core support, that uh, radiator support will probably get notched out so the bigger, better one will fit in there. We're gonna have to take that bumper off. That way we can have plenty of room to slide the new one in. But that is going to be it. Thanks for watching the resurrection of Project Sin. Hopefully it won't take five years. <laughs>